Today, I'm gonna show you how to activate with Posca markers. Cause I know I just upload a short video about Posca's gone wrong because you can see the tip of the Posca marker. It doesn't have a pigment inside. So they just told me in my shorts about for some comments that they told me last week. So yeah, this is the right technique for you is how to activate by using Posca markers. All right, let's start. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take my Posca marker out and I'm just gonna open it and what you're gonna do is to follow these steps of how to activate with Posca markers because I know I have seen some videos or the shorts of how to activate with the markers that's been right or wrong so to do this technique all you have to do is step one you just push it you can push the tip uh, more than one time but just a few times and wait till the pigment runs on the tip. So just wait. You see the tip, it has a pigment on there. So I'm just gonna push it up. And you see, it has color on it. So for this video, let me explain is that we're gonna swatch the colors by Posca markers. So we're just gonna do all of these one by one in a fast motion. So I'm just gonna set up the music. If you feel about like that, yeah, because I have this paper over there on top of the wood. Yeah. All right, let's get swatching.
So what we're gonna do is the last marker white because I know the paper is white. So I just watch all of these colors. So let's see if I can uh, swatch the white Posca marker. I'm sure guys you'll see it on the paper. Because I know this is just watching. You see the white color that I swatch onto this paper? So, whenever you are uh, doing with the Posca pens, you just try to take your time. Like whether if the ink has become it's dried from the Posca marker tip, and it might gonna even reproduce with color because you see that uh sometimes the color can be scratchy like you know on the paper it feels like texture but this method talks to you about that is revolutionary so you understand that and thank you for watching this tutorial and the uh, swatching colors. Make sure you subscribe and don't forget to write down comments in the below. Alright, I'll see you again next time.